All right, we are back with the turbo mini bike. Um, last video, I uh, had this out. It made like eight pounds, and uh, I bent a valve. So I actually went ahead and threw a billet motor in. This is a 212 non-hemi uh, billet plus 40 rod. It had a flat top piston. I swapped that for the stock dish piston so I could uh, drop the compression. It's got a milled imported head. Um, the whole nine yards, you know, cam, billet flywheel, billet rod, all that. So, uh, I figured this would be a better motor. Currently, this, this is not a complete setup. Uh, I am splashing oil out of, I believe, right here. Uh, that's the old oil sensor that I just cut. Um, I decided to leave it in instead of plugging the hole because I figured that would hold the oil. But, uh, I believe it is just pushing it right past that. So, um, I'll probably have to pull this thing apart and seal that up. I also have not vented this crankcase to atmosphere, so I am expecting to uh, maybe push a little oil out of the exhaust and the turbo, so if that happens, it's not a big deal. I just got to be easy on it and ride it back. Get the oil going. Um, I also have not mounted my oil pump yet. That is just hanging. Uh, held up by zip ties, so disregard that. With this motor, since I'm running a plus 40 thou rod, I had to stack two 36 thou head gaskets and that's because I had about 17 thou of piston pop up uh, which is less than ideal but um, these MLS gaskets stack pretty good and they seem to be holding up so far so we're gonna run it so we're gonna go ahead and fire this thing up and take it for a little test ride and hopefully nothing uh, explodes smoking a lot on that last pole and it seemed a little lean so we're only gonna do one more here Yeah, we're blowing some oil past the seals, so I'm gonna have to vent this crankcase, which I knew I'd have to do. Uh, this is all dripping oil, so that's gonna have to be addressed. As you can see, this thing is blowing oil all over the place. It's, uh, it's already dripping off it, so I'm gonna clean that up and uh, yeah, catch you guys in the next one. <laughs> 